now after completing the toolbar options now we are going to teach you the menu bar options the first menu bar options is called the file options within this file options we are getting so many options the first option is new new is only used for to open a new file anything whatever you can do now closing for the closing that particularly file now once again select the file there is another option called the file open a file to open any new image you can select the image and you can open it now close for close the image file now once again go to the file options there is another option called the browse option select that one now we can see the upper left hand side there is a one options where the directory is mentioned the left hand side within this directory where the your images are there we can select that particular directory and all the images are going to show to the right hand side window and we can see the thumbnail view of the images to select that image twice if you click double click over the image we can get the image within the window we can open it so it's better we can see at a time and whichever our choice will picture we can select from here so now we can close the all the images now there is another options called the this open as open as is used for which mode we are going to open that particular file there are so many options file types option is there we can choose one of them according to our choice which mode if you want you can open to this one now this is actually not required for the digital uh image composing and open recent is used only for which is which are the files you open this is just mention that's all and the later on there is another option which is called the close option when we are going to open a new file we can close directly the cross sign click over the cross sign or we can close this close option now once again there is another options called the save option for that reason we are going to open a new file and we can save this file before saving that we can create any shape or create anything we can draw now select the blue color now we are going to save this one selecting the save option go to the file option save select the directory now is the name of that file now we we are going to save that file in photoshop format psd format we can choose the format actually now the file is already saved i'm going to close that file there's a other option which is called the open which is already saved that file dd file you already saved and we can open to the open option now we are going to close that file now once again there is another option called the save as for that one we are going to open a new file and before that we are going to open an image which is we already saved it and we can save save as in a different format like the jpg or bitmap or bmp which one you feel comfortable or according to your quality according to your choice according to your requirement now we are going to save in a jpg format there is another options which is showing the image options the quality of the image we are getting if i increase the quality of the image is increasing now the file is already saved we are going to close that file now there is another options which is called revert option revert option is nothing but whatever the whatever the images you just moved into a new file or you just did the work over a new background file or an image if anything mistake is happen or 
unfortunately you did something else and you can get back that particular image once again select the revert option you can get back your image but this thing only happens when you didn't save that particular image now we are going to close that file so once again within the file options we are getting other options which is called the automatic option within this automatic options you are getting the other option which is called the contact sheet part 2 now contact sheet 2 is particularly used to select the multiple images at a time within a thumbnail views for that one the first option is browse where we can select the directory where the images are there press ok and then press ok now opening an new file and all the images are making automatically as a thumbnail view over the new file this file such a file is used actually when covering the CD or we already seen on a film CD where all the images is covered over the one particular CD or CD cover. Now we are going to close that file. Now once again going to the file options. The last option is exit option to exit or to quit the software. Now once again opening the Adobe Photoshop. Within these file options whatever we already teach that is actually the used for the digital image composing now the next option is edit options 